Hey everyone and welcome to this week's q and I hope you had a great week and welcome back. Welcome to the snow. Here we are already. Um, wanted to do a quick little video today about the top GTA markets. So as you heard, hopefully last week, if you watched the show, we talked about how much the market has increased, particularly in detached homes. And we've seen a nice increase across the board. And in fact, 88% of the neighborhoods in the GTA saw an increase in detached home prices last month. So I thought I would bring you an interesting little video about what the top neighborhoods were in terms of increases. Uh, so that will give you a good idea of whether or not you want to avoid them or try to purchase in those. The first one is E1. That is the uh, lower east end of the city, Riverdale, um, Leslieville, in and around there, where we saw a 15.2% increase in detached home prices last month, and it brought the average price to $1.378 million. The second was C1. Now that's downtown that runs from the lake up to Bloor, basically through the central core, where most of you know there's not a lot of detached homes, which is partly why the average price of a detached home there is 1.9 million and change. And that was a 12.8% increase over last year. So very strong market there as well. And then of course C11, and this is nice because C11, which is uh, Lee Side and around Thorncliffe, They've had some uh, slower months over the last year or two, but this time they had a great showing. They were third in terms of over, overall um, increase, and that is an increase of 11.2% this month. And that brought the average price of a home in that neighborhood at almost 2.2 million. So what does that mean for you? Uh, just gives you a very good idea of the markets that are very strong in the city. And so for those of you that may try to buy into these markets or strong markets, this is where you need to look. Um, there's also some other good markets that have shown good increases in detached homes. We've got a whole list of those on our blog. And so feel free to reach out and check that out. And uh, there'll be a link here below. Hope that helps. Uh, you know I'm here. If you have any questions about the value of your property or anything else real estate related, just let us know. And please feel free to like and share with anyone you think might be interested. Hope you have a great day and we'll see you soon. Bye for now.